Hi everyone, welcome to the YouTube channel. This video is all about AI Influencer Tensor Art Tutorial. Here we will see how you can create an AI influencer that you can use for Instagram or maybe any other social media app. These days it is very in trend that people have made influencer that are not real, these are AI generated and they actually use them as real people on Instagram mostly and they actually earn with the help of it. So today we will see how we can create one with the help of tensor art. So first you have to go to the browser and then you have to search for tensor art or you can also find its link in the description below. Once you get to its platform you will see this interface. First it might ask you to get login and you just have to login and there you will see a lot of different templates and models that you can use. As we are here to create an AI influencer therefore we have to choose a model that looks realistic. But you also have to make sure that it does not have this exclusive option because this one is a paid one. So here we have to find a model which looks hyper realistic and it is also free. So you can just simply use any one of these let's say if you choose one this one or maybe the one that you find you can just simply click onto it and after that this profile will open of this AI model and there you can see different options. So this is how it looks here we have different options as you can see. So here I don't think so that this one will work because it has different faces so I'm just gonna get back and choose another one. So let's see what we can find. So the purpose behind the AI influencer is that they should look exactly like actual humans so you have to keep that in mind and use the models that looks exactly real that are hyper realistic. So you just have to simply explore and find the one. If you couldn't find the one that you're looking for you can also search for it and if you have your own model that you have launched you can also use it but if it is hyper realistic then you can use it otherwise you just have to find from that. So I'm just going to use the one that I just saw earlier, this one, I just simply clicked onto it and after that its profile will open. So this is the model as you can see it has all these images and this actually looks really nice. So now what you have to do is that once you get there you will see this remix option. You just have to simply click onto it and after that its profile will open. So on the left side we have this model, this is what we are going to keep. And this is the main thing that we have to work on which is the prompt. So this one model is actually on public and anybody can use it. So if anybody can use it that means they can also create the same AI influencer that you will create. So if you don't want that then you have to do changes in your prompts. If you go with the same prompt then obviously you will get the same images that any other person could make. Therefore you have to make your character unique. You have to do the changes in this prompt. You can completely change it if you would like to but it will be hard for you to keep that for future ones so I would suggest that you should do changings into it and you can also do the changings in a negative prompt that you don't need and after that you can choose the aspect ratio mostly Instagram takes the square one and after that you may skip all these options because these are not necessary and then you can choose how many pictures you want once you have selected click on generate. Now as we have chosen 4 results therefore it will take around 2 to 3 minutes to generate images. So once these images will be created we will have 4 images. From these 4 images we can create an account and use these ones. One could be used as a profile picture and others for just the post. And likewise once these 4 created you will create more photos but you will do some of the changings in the prompt. So you will keep doing it and you will keep creating multiple photos and after that you will also keep putting all these images on Instagram or maybe on a other platform. So that's how you will keep going your AI influencers profile on social media. So here we have to wait until this progress completes. Once this loading is done we will get the results in which we will have 4 different images of our AI influencer. And here you can see we have these images. So it has created these images as I described in prompt and it is actually hyper realistic. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to take one of these images, will put it as a profile picture of my social media's AI influencer and the other images will be used as post. So after these images will be created, I will do some of the changes in prompt and we'll keep creating more and more images and we'll also keep putting them on social media 
and if you're wondering how you can install or download these images so what you can do is that here we have this option for batch download you can download them in batch or otherwise you can just simply click on to every one of these images and you will see this option for download from there you can download them and can use them anywhere wherever you would like to one thing you also have to keep that in mind when you're doing changings in the prompt you should not change the whole prompt at once because if you do so then you will lose the unique style of your ai influencer so you have to keep that in mind that you only do some minimal changings like in the style and appearance but not too much so that's how you can create ai influencer with the help of tensor art i hope you found this video helpful and informative in case if you have not subscribed to the youtube channel then make sure to subscribe it for more informative videos and updates also press the bell icon button so you can get all the notification thank you so much for watching the video till the very end